Colleagues and friends, I'm honored to be joining you from the traditional territory of Niasquak, the Ermanskin Cree Nation. It has been a very difficult year. We mourn the loss of life and are mindful of the increased inequality and vulnerability resulting from the pandemic. Nevertheless, I believe with mutual respect and compassion as our guidepost for humanity, together we can move forward with hope and build the world envisioned in the 2030 Agenda, a resilient and inclusive world that leaves no one behind. In Canada, we have wasted no time at home or abroad to deal with the impacts of the COVID-19 pandemic. We're working hard to eliminate the barriers to prosperity and inclusion, especially for the most vulnerable in our societies. Car nous savons que nous avons tout un rôle à jouer because we all have a role to play. Respect for human rights and the advancement of gender equality are at the heart of implementing the 2030 Agenda and to recovering from the pandemic. We know that all levels of government have a role to play in achieving sustainable development. La lutte contre les changements climatiques est le grand défi de notre époque. La relance de nos économies doit donc être verte et inclusive. Dans le respect de l'accord de Paris, le Canada et l'ensemble des villes canadiennes redoublent d'efforts pour atteindre des objectifs toujours plus ambitieux liés au climat. Nous nous engageons à travailler de manière solidaire pour assurer un environnement sain, sûr et durable pour les générations actuelles et futures. The pandemic has forced us to recognize that business as usual is not enough. It is magnified where stronger efforts are required to ensure safer, more resilient communities. It has shown us that economic recovery goes hand in hand with public health and reducing inequality. Recently, we launched our national strategy for the 2030 Agenda, an ambitious program that will ensure that no one is left behind. Internationally, our feminist international assistance policy guides Canada's implementation of the 2030 Agenda. However, we also recognize how our international assistance, our inclusive approach to trade, and our feminist foreign policy are mutually reinforcing. Together, they guide our support for greater peace, inclusion, justice, resilience, and prosperity for all. Above all, we are applying a sustainable development lens to all our international activities for greater effectiveness, coherence, and impact. To achieve a better and more sustainable future, we have to make sure that no one is left behind. We have to ensure that everyone has the necessary tools to achieve prosperity and be included fully in our communities.